Hello, this is our second of five giveaways of the big box sets from the Games Workshop range. Uh, this week we're going to be doing the Battle for Pelennor Fields, Battle of Pelennor Fields, uh, Middle Earth set. Um, so today is Tuesday the 4th of May, the competition runs until Friday at 3 o'clock, which will be the 5th, 6th, 7th of May. Um, the way to enter, because I don't think it was 100% clear on the last video, so apologies for that. But the way to enter is to comment on the Facebook post. If you have commented on the Facebook post, I can put you in the draw. And then we double check that the winner subscribes to our YouTube channel. So this is for so our YouTube subscribers, and you have to simply comment on the Facebook post in order to enter. If you want to share the post, please do so, uh, but you don't need to share it in order to enter. <clears throat> so. This week's prize, the Pelennor Fields box, just to tell you a bit more about that. Uh, it retails at £95, uh, but it comes with quite a range of uh, units in it, um, and, and it's just incredible value, really. You get a rule book, that's not the rule book, this is the armies of Lord of the Rings books, the rule books at home, uh, <laughs> I've been reading that. Um, it comes with a scenario book as well, which has all the stats for the units that come with the book and four different scenarios that you can play as well. Um, but what's most impressive in this set is the range of models. Uh, on the evil side, you get the Witch King of Angmar uh, on Fell Beast, which you can also do up as a general Nazgul. You get a Mordor Troll, um, which is three different ways of doing uh, doing it, that, that up. Um, no fewer than 36 uh, Moran and Orcs on the evil side, so quite a nice little army there. And then on the good side, uh, the army is led by King Theoden, who's here on his horse. There's also a model of him just stood again, that's on my paint table. Uh, you get 12 Rohan riders, 12 Rohan warriors on foot, um, and then, then Warriors of the Dead, I think there's 20 in that unit as well. If you price up on the Games Workshop website each and every one of these units and the rule book, <clears throat> I think it's something like £230 worth of uh, product separately. So first of all, a £95 box set, it's pretty good value, but obviously incredible value if you can win it in this competition as well. Middle Earth for me is probably the best gameplay of any of the um, Games Workshop games. It's really uh, thematic with how you, they move the characters, um, and what the heroes can do and the different traits of the different units and so forth. It doesn't lend itself to a campaign as well as things like Warhammer or, or Necromunda and things like that, but as a standalone game, it's fantastic to play. For any Lord of the Rings uh, fans out there, uh, it's great fun. It's a great way to get into tabletop if you're a Lord of the Rings uh, fan as well. So um, good luck to everybody. Again, just to reiterate, comment on the Facebook post, subscribe to the YouTube channel, uh, if you comment on the Facebook post, you are in the draw. Um, it's only done by 3 o'clock on Friday the 7th of May. Uh, and we'll double check the winner is subscribing to our YouTube channel. Uh, and obviously we've got more box sets to give away in the next few weeks as well. Uh, so good luck and uh, thanks.